And tonight, Metro Police tell us multiple people are under arrest accused of various drug and illegal firearms offenses. John Duran tells us police credit the arrest to community members who are providing tips. Police say they arrested two suspects for selling drugs out of an east side tire shop. Earlier this month, members of the SWAT team found two loaded handguns, cocaine, pills, and marijuana there. IMPD says the illegal activity was reported by a community member here and given to the Violent Crimes Task Force. They were able to take the little bit of information and develop it into a case that in, ended up resulting in probable cause enough to serve a warrant and uh, make, some, make some actionable arrests. Days later, tips of narcotics and firearms dealing on Indy's southwest side led to the arrest of a known felon on Lyons Avenue. Two days later, SWAT team members seized five firearms, including two that were stolen from a suspect who allegedly threatened to kill people, including children, and threatened an officer. A day after that, members of the SWAT team found fentanyl, meth, pills, and a loaded shotgun inside a home near Rodius Park. Two suspects were arrested. Police say the investigation started after residents in the area tipped off police. Hopefully the work we do today makes tomorrow safer than today. Uh, so any illegal guns or any narcotics that we can get off the streets, um, that's a big win, especially for our uh, community and our neighbors. Um, and we really appreciate the tips that they give us uh, because we can't do it all on our own. We can't be everywhere. IMPD hopes these six arrests over the course of a week send a strong message to criminals. We're not going to stop. Uh, we're not going to stop looking. Um, we're not going to stop pursuing them. Uh, that's what we're here for. In Indianapolis, John Duran, 13 News.